comes onto the table, so it's wilted and tossed and turned. Um, once it's soft enough to uh, where the stem isn't going to split or crack because all that water content inside the stem makes it really crisp. So once it's soft enough that it bends uh, all the way around, so if you can bend the, the stem on the, I'm speaking for black tea, so, uh, or oolong as you, <laughs> you tasted it. Um, but essentially, if you can bend it and make a full U out of it without, without it cracking, then it's wilted enough that it's soft enough to go into the roller. Okay, I was wondering if it's hand rolled or mechanical. Nope, yeah, we use the mechanical rollers. Mechanical, yeah. huh. So the idea here is uh, we, we compress, roll tight, and then stop, open the top, let it breathe, and then compress it down uh, softly, not, not hard, just above the, the, basically the bed, and then roll again, uh, and then breathe, and then bring it down and, and roll again, compress, and then we go back and forth, back and forth until it's fully rolled. Hmm. Yeah. And then you just pretty much count down how long it takes to ferment or whatever, how many hours you let it since it's been bruised. How long yep. you let it just basically sit there? Yeah, yeah, and we did, so we did experiments last season, you got to taste it, we did uh, basically very, very minimal uh, oxidation where we're basically trying to dry it as fast as possible yeah. uh, to limit that fermentation or oxidation. And uh, again, that's like the definition of a new long, it really is. Yeah, yeah. so I think that's really more of what we ended up creating. Uh, but then we did also uh, like a three hour intentional, uh, uh, we did five hour, seven hour, nine hour, 13 hour, and even longer than that, because uh, it gets real cold uh, here up on the mountain. Um, so I think what we found and tasted the best was the nine hour, right? Yeah. So, and then there, this is actually a, a village community production facility that was funded by the government. <laughs> So uh, actually anybody who's growing tea here can come and use it. So a lot of the commercial tea is using the, the drum, drum roaster, but yeah.